Hi, this is Rebecca with Atmosphere Fitness. I'm here today to show you four of the exercises from the Thrower's 10, and we'll have two more videos that show the rest of the Thrower's 10. The Thrower's 10 is a series of exercises that can help strengthen the shoulder girdle, um, working into everything from the rotator cuff to even into some of the smaller muscles that connect in. And as aerialists and polars, it's important that we're strong there and we're also strengthening muscles equally so that we don't have of balance. So the first exercise I'm going to show you is called Diagonal Pattern V2 Extension. And this is a movement that comes across the body, again working in the shoulder area. We start with our cable, I've got a band happening, you can use a cable pull machine, um, that is really the best, the best method with this, but you can use a band. So I'm going to take this band and I'm going to bring it across and down to the opposite leg. So I lift up, come across and down. And I actually can come out even further on this so that I get a little more work in that shoulder. Across and down the body so that I'm working in here. So this next move is diagonal pattern DT flexion. So again, working the shoulders. What's a little tricky with this one is we want to watch what our palm is doing. So I'm going to start with the band low and I want to bring the palm starting down and back and then as I come up I'm going to lift that palm forward. So I lift up, I have a little bend in this elbow, I want to make sure I'm strong here and not hyperextending and then I come back down. So I rotate up, rotate down. This is going to work on that rotation in a forward movement like this. Rotating up, rotating down. Our next exercise is an external rotation with a zero degree abduction. So we want to make sure that we've got a little 90 degree angle happening here and then I'm not down here or trying to lift up here. I'm right at center. I want to make sure I've got tension in the band and my band is now in alignment with this 90 degree. It's about elbow height. I'm going to use my shoulder and arm and I open away and then come back to that 90 degree right alignment with the shoulder. So I just open out and in working on that rotation. So the fourth exercise is an internal rotation with a zero degree abduction. So I'm starting again out in this bent 90 degree angle. I've got the band lined up about elbow height so that I can rotate inward and outward. And this needs to be this inward movement. I come back to being in alignment with my shoulder. So we're focusing on this inward move right here. 